It's usually your thing to come running to me for help. But... Maggie, this is not a good time. That's the thing with emergencies. They tend to be inconvenient. And who is she exactly? Her sister, unfortunately. You're pretending to be me? Fenric the Vile? It is I, your all-powerful, oversexed overlord. Not to get too touchy-feely here, but don't you think that's a bit invasive? Mel's in danger. Just when I was beginning to desire me, respect you, you go off and reclaim the demon overlord title. And who are you? Her latest girlfriend? Respect is overrated. I prefer to be feared. So I've heard. I am not her girlfriend. Is that a... Did you... How did you... I need to get a demonic password to bring a goal into life. Maggie, you should have asked me to get it. I couldn't be certain you'd say yes. And there was no time. So who's the lucky woman? Your partner in the future. Not sure. Future Mel wasn't really a sharer. No, then there's still a chance it could be a certain English frenemy. Do not test me today, Abby. I am tired, hormonal, and I can't even help my sister save the world. So tell me what's going on, I swear to God. Yes? I'd feel a lot better if you were in the room with me while I slept. Don't push it, Abby. Admit it, you care about me. Don't push it, Abby. Ab what's the matter? You've never seen a pregnant woman before? Please tell me you're not going to put our child in that death trap of a crib you're building. To tighten 10 inch bolts B, C, and F. <laughs> How did this become my life? Abby? Well, hello. You're just in time for Lemon Blueberry Scones. <laughs> oh. Oh, God. Abby, don't give up. You can't. I thought you'd be delighted to have me out of your simply styled but lovely hair. <laughs> there, there. A witch almost died because of you and your demon. I haven't the foggiest notion what you're on about. Ladies, I'm sure there's a much more diplomatic. Yeah. What? Stay out of this, Jordan. Or not. Enough. I already have one child to worry about. I can't handle two more. Apparently, you're more vicious than ever. I relax. No witches were harmed in the making of this overlord. Abby, I don't have time for this. You're going to have to deal with your monsters all by your lonesome. Wait, you're not gonna stay with me. I'm a fighter. I'm not a mother and I can't help but feel like I'm gonna, I'm gonna let this baby down. Stupid hormones. If I can't even build a crib, how the hell am I supposed to raise a child? Now look at me. You have far too much love in your heart to ever be a bad mom but I never thought she'd do anything like this until I found out you didn't send the demon. Then I knew. You really went to all these lengths to make amends with me, see? Yes. Mel, you fought to save us, all while keeping your baby safe. Being a fighter is exactly what will make you a fantastic mom.